We are here today to talk about the audio link function on the Traveler 8 and Traveler 10 series portable PA speakers. First off, what we're going to do is transmit audio from a mobile phone to our Bluetooth input on our Traveler 10. And we will then transmit from the main Traveler 10 via the audio link transmitter to a wireless receiver built into a second satellite Traveler 10 unit. You've got a few different things going on that you need to be aware of. One, you've got your mobile device. You want to make sure the volume is turned up. There is a volume control for the Bluetooth input section on the Traveler 10. You also have the master control on your main unit. You have control of the volume of your satellite speakers from your main unit with the volume knob here on the audio link transmitter. We're going to be checking that as well to make sure we've got audio transmitting over to our satellite speaker. This unit has a volume control on this receiver in addition to its own master volume control on the unit itself. So first thing that we're going to do is start with our volumes down and then we're going to get some program going. We're going to turn the Bluetooth up a little bit and then check to make sure that we've got audio coming through to the main traveler. We do. So now we're going to turn the volume up a little on the audio link transmitter. Next, we're going to go to our satellite unit and we're going to turn our master up just a little and then turn the receiver up so we know we're actually transmitting from a mobile phone to our main traveler and then transmitting to our satellite traveler speaker. Now we're going from the mobile phone to the main traveler unit and out of its audio link transmitter and into the satellite wireless receivers and then out to the speaker. So you've got a couple cool things you can do here. We can control the main traveler volume with its master control and that won't have any effect on the satellite speakers. However, if we change the volume of the Bluetooth on our mobile phone, that will adjust its volume across all connected speakers. If we adjust the volume knob on the audio link transmitter, that affects volume on any and all satellite speakers. Each speaker you can control individually. If you had a room and you wanted to have multiple travelers, you could have that volume control set different for each speaker. Now, if you wanted to turn the volume off for all of them or up or down, you can just go to your main unit and adjust the audio link transmitter volume, and that will actually affect all of the satellite travelers so that you'll turn all of them up or down together. To demonstrate the voice priority, the voice priority is going to carry through the main traveler and all linked satellite speakers. With the voice priority engaged in the main traveler, indicated by the light here, what's really cool is that we got music playing from the main traveler. As soon as I want to make an announcement, the voice priority is going to knock down the volume of the music program we have playing and give priority to the announcement being given over the microphone. Check one, two, check one, two, check, check. Once I'm done talking, you'll hear the music go back up to the previous volume on its own automatically. So it's vitally important to make sure that your audio link transmitter is set up on the same frequency as your satellite speaker's receiver and that this frequency is not the same as any other wireless microphones that you may be using with your main traveler unit. So we've got different frequencies set up on our wireless microphones. Then we've got say channel 25 set down here on audio link transmitter and that corresponds with channel 25 on the wireless satellite speaker. Visit galaxyaudio.com for information on this and our other great products. Galaxy Audio, superior sound for you.